there I am inside my university's data center. Engineers at my university and around the world use computation to solve real world problems. You can use these supercomputers or just a notebook to solve real problems in engineering. I'm Jeff Chasnov and I'm a professor of mathematics at the Hong Kong University of Science and Technology. Welcome to my course on numerical methods for engineers. What are numerical methods? They are algorithms we use to solve mathematical equations. Mathematical models are fundamental to science and engineering and are usually impossible to solve with just pen and paper. We need to use computers, and computers need algorithms. The real world problems that we want to solve are often hard, like predicting the weather, or predicting the path of a hurricane. Let's have a quick look to see how engineers use computers to solve hard problems. Mechanical and aerospace engineers use computational fluid dynamics to optimize ventilation systems and design aerodynamic cars and aerodynamic airplanes. Geoengineers use numerical climate models to study climate change and global warming. Bioengineers use systems biology to understand immunology, cell biology, and genomics. Chemical engineers use computational chemistry to develop new drugs. And computer engineers and data scientists use machine learning for speech recognition, healthcare, and fraud detection. All of these engineers need to use numerical methods. We'll learn the basic methods in this course and how to write numerical codes using the MATLAB programming language. Let me tell you how my course is organized. My theoretical lectures on numerical methods will be given on a light board so I can talk to you directly as I explain the basic ideas and algorithms. We'll make use of a lot of the math you've already learned in my other courses on matrix algebra, differential equations, and vector calculus. After each lecture, I'll give you a few problems to solve so that you can practice what you've learned. I'll also teach you how to use MATLAB. I'll demonstrate how to write code to solve some typical problems. We'll look at some interesting numerical examples in this course. We'll create some beautiful fractals and solve Newton's laws for masses attracted by gravity. We're lucky in this course to have free access to MATLAB. And you can use MATLAB online to write your codes and the MATLAB grader to check them. To wrap up each week, there'll be an assess quiz and a fun programming project. To pass this course, you'll need to understand both basic numerical methods and their MATLAB implementation. If you want to learn the theory behind widely used numerical methods and write code in MATLAB, join me in Numerical Methods for Engineers.